Actor Michael Douglas's claim that he got throat cancer from oral sex has a lot of people talking about HPV, but can this really happen? In an interview with The Guardian, Michael Douglas said the throat cancer he battled with in 2010 was caused by HPV. The virus is known to cause multiple kinds of different cancer. Rates of HPV-related cancers have risen dramatically in recent years, even as lower smoking rates have reduced the incidence of many other cancers. The American Cancer Society has even called it, quote, one of the epidemics of the 21st century. Recently, one type of HPV, HPV-16, has been found to cause throat cancer, also known as oral pharyngeal cancer. In the United States, more than half of the cancers diagnosed in the oral pharynx are linked to HPV-16. But one recent study shows the partners of those diagnosed with cancer caused by HPV aren't at a higher risk of contracting the virus. Here's a breakdown of the study from DailyRx. Researchers looked at 147 HPV-positive throat cancer patients and 83 of their partners. Most of the participants were male with female partners. Here's what they found. About 7.2% of partners had oral HPV. 5% of women had the virus, which is about what the general population has. Only 2.7% of women had the cancer-related HPV-16, which none of the male partners had. Oral HPV was higher among the male partners, 29% compared to only 5% of the female partners. And no cancer or precancers were detected in the partners who had a visual oral exam. And MedPage today notes the higher numbers among men may be a little skewed because very few male participants were part of the study, but the HPV rate is higher among middle-aged men in the general population anyway. According to Science Daily, the lead author of the study cautioned more research needs to be done to determine the timeline of progression for HPV-related cancers. For Newsy, I'm Jasmine Bailey, Multiple Sources, A Broader View.